And back here at home, more debate this noon over that Frank Rizzo statue in Center City. Police say they have arrested a man who was accused of throwing eggs at the bronze statue this morning. Vandals also threw eggs at the statue last night. Now, fencing did go up between the two incidents. Supporters are pushing back against the councilwoman's call to remove Rizzo's statue from city property. Our Trang Doe spoke to the man who started a petition to keep the statue where it is. Mark Ferguson stopped by the city's municipal services building to check on the statue of Frank Rizzo early Wednesday. Tuesday night, he saw the news that it had been vandalized with an anti-Trump sign and egged. As someone who grew up with the Rizzo family, Ferguson feels it's his duty to protect the monument. It's about principle. That's why he started a petition on change.org to gather support against efforts to take it down. This is not a symbol of hate. There is a, a long-standing legacy around racism um, that we have to have to have hard conversations about. Councilwoman at large Helen Gim is calling on the statue of the former mayor and police commissioner to be removed. Gim and others say they're troubled by allegations that African Americans were routinely targeted and brutalized during Rizzo's tenure from the late 60s to 1980. I think anything that symbolizes racism, take it down. It's real simple. We spoke to a number of people just walking past the Rizzo statue today, and for them, its presence is not as divisive. Sort of like a guy that had to take care of business. At that time, in that era, in Pennsylvania and in Philadelphia, oh, we needed that. We needed that. So, I like the statue. Well, I think they should leave it there, because I come by here every day on a bus or whatever, and when I'm out here working in the city, I usually stop by the statue. In Center City, I'm trying to CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Now, a spokesperson for Mayor Kenny released this statement, quote, we think now is a good time to have that conversation about the statue's future. We need to figure out the proper forum for that conversation in a serious, structured way, but now is the right time.